Hey guys, this is Mike Leonardi. We're at the NURAC Institute for Physical Therapy. I'm here with Tyler Joyce, PT and Master Instructor for Red Cord USA. Uh, we at Red Cord USA feel that there is not enough focus on exercises for neck stability, especially in the younger populations. So today we're going to give you guys a couple of basic exercises you can do for neck stability. These could be done as standalone exercise programs every single day, or you can do them and fit them in between your normal strength programming uh, in the gym. So uh, here we go. All right, so here we have uh, Mike's position where he's going to be loading the posterior aspect of his cervical spine. Mike is doing this exercise from the red cord trainer, but it can also be done from a mini as well. He's using the narrow sling, which comes in uh, most packages, but you could also use the wide sling as well, and we also have a split sling, which is perfect for neck uh, stabilizing exercises. So what Mike is going to do is put his weight through the narrow sling to, to load the posterior aspect of his neck. If the exercise is too difficult, Mike can regress it by taking a slight step back and find a desired uh, level to, to load his neck. Now again, all these exercises are going to be done from the neutral, neutral position. If the exercise is too easy, or yeah, too easy, Mike can take a step forward, load the neck even more. Um, again, maintaining the neutral position, but also the neutral position at the lumbar spine as well. To engage more muscles along the kinetic chain, Mike can also come up on his tippy toes. So now that's engaging more muscles along the, the posterior chain. Um, Mike can also advance this exercise even further by even doing a squat. So you can add some dynamic movements in there to load the posterior aspect of the, of the cervical spine. 